A new semester starts this Friday for public schools nationwide at the high school level and below. On Wednesday in Shinju City, a mass disinfection campaign got underway at 69 schools. Over in Taipei, disinfection crews were also at work making their way across 291 schools. According to the latest Taipei City guidelines, schools will be required to close for 14 days if they find even one confirmed case. Led by school administrators, Shinju Mayor Lin Zhijian makes his way across campus on an inspection tour. The school is pulling up the stops for pandemic prevention in preparation for the start of a new semester. The principals and teachers at our schools have been working hard these days. Ahead of the kids starting class, the schools are taking intensive precautions against COVID. The spring semester starts this Friday, but teachers have already returned to campus to clean and sanitize the space. In Shinju City, disinfection was conducted at 69 schools at the primary and secondary levels. Turning north to Taipei, where cleanup was also underway. The city's Department of Environmental Protection sent disinfection teams to schools before the start of spring semester. Taipei's Department of Environmental Protection targeted high schools, vocational schools, junior highs, elementary schools and public preschools. That's a total of 291 schools, plus campus spaces open to the public. They were all disinfected. While city crews cleaned the campus grounds, homeroom teachers were tasked with disinfecting their own classrooms. <laughs> Schools have prepared temperature log sheets, along with a suite of COVID prevention rules. Ahead of the new semester, Taipei City announced its latest citywide guidelines. If one student or teacher tests positive for COVID, the whole school must close for 14 days. Teachers must be fully vaccinated for at least 14 days before returning to school. Parents and other visitors are not to be allowed on campus. We already have everything ready for remote teaching, and every month we need to hold a distance learning drill with the children and their parents. Even if school is suspended, the children will not stop learning. Teachers hustle about, leaving no corner of campus untouched as they clean. In the wake of Spring Festival, schools are on high alert for COVID contracted over the holiday. They're taking every precaution to ensure their students' safe return.